Hey everybody, welcome to part 3 of my video review of Transformer Deluxe Class Bumblebee from the Transformers movie. There's there's him in his splendid robot mode. Just giving you a quick glance. I got his weapons in there so that you can kind of see. So to transform him back into his alternate Chimera mode, go ahead and remove those. We're going to take those off, put those off to the side. Get those way out of the way. Got them just like so. Now what I go ahead and do first is take his arms, get him back in the position kind of where the panels are lined up on the sides, just like so. Then go ahead and take the feet, rotate those down. Well, first you need to slide this panel. So go ahead and push that up through the heel pretty much if you push that that'll slide this back down and then rotate the foot clip that right into place hopefully that showed fairly well what you want to do like I said just kind of put your finger thumb here whatever in the heel area just kind of push that up and as you push that up this front piece will slide back into its place then you have the foot like this, just go ahead and take that, fold that right back up, bring, them, bring the two legs together, just mesh them right into the pegs that are there, and you got his back section ready to go. Real simple for that. Then what you want to do, go ahead and take the heels, or I'm sorry, the the windows, flip those panels right back to the side, right back to the side, lower that down, and while you do that, you can just slide the front windshield underneath there, take the doors, get those locked into place, just kind of wiggle them in there, they'll fit, just like so. Go ahead and take the front section. Well, first you need to rotate Mr. Bumblebee's head. I wonder if you can just leave it like that. I'm going to leave it like that and give it a try. Take the arms and extend them up and then rotate them down. So that now you have the wheels flush. Go ahead and get these pieces here, right in here. You want to get those pushed right back in, the tabs underneath just like so on the side right here kinda clips into a little spot same for the other side just kinda push in right there right by the door make sure that this front piece is up take the front section rotate it up here just slide it back into place Autobot symbol tuck underneath See. I like Bumblebee like that, so it's easier to transform him, I guess. But uh, there he is. Oh, can't see him. That's Bumblebee back in his car mode. Very nice. Uh, as you can see, it's an easy transformation back into his alternate truck mode. Or, I'm sorry, alternate Camaro mode. Um, very, very simple. I really, really enjoy this figure, but uh, I hope you will as well. There is uh, some problems here with the keeping everything all flush. Hopefully that doesn't wear out in the future and doesn't stay flush anymore, but uh, we'll see with time. But um, there you have, ladies and gentlemen, my video review. This is actually pretty short. My video review of Autobot Bumblebee in his alternate mode. I wonder if put these little fellas right in here. Will those spin? Yeah. Yeah, put those little things in there. He's got little side cannons now. <laughs> and that's retarded. But, whee, look, I can shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Um, the one thing I did want to show you real quick. These weapons are launchable. i show you here. Oh, yeah, see. They launch pretty good. Just like so. But, um, so, 
There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Stay tuned for my other video reviews. I will be doing my uh, Concept Mumblebee here in a couple days as soon as it gets in the mail. And I'll get the the variant version of Bumblebee as well and just kind of highlight that and show you the difference. But, um... Let's see, keep that locked in there. See, there that goes again. But, um, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Autobot Bumblebee. The wheels roll pretty good, too. Pretty happy. Alright, so stay tuned. Thanks for tuning in. Very quick. I'll shut up. Have a great day, guys.